How we doing today? Heading down to the dock here at the lake to meet up with one of my longtime friends. See what we can do here. Catch up with you on the chest mount. Oh, oh shit. Damn it, I got a duck. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> you got, dude, get him and cut it. Uh, probably about 12. Yeah. Uh, just a Texas rig. I don't care. Oh, cut the cut the rig off. Just just cut the the end of the line. Can you swim through your or fly through your line? Yeah. Okay, so just experienced the fishing first for me. Um, I cast it out near a dock, and the dock happened to have some ducks, some mallard ducks, just kind of sitting on it, hanging out. And the line, the and the cast spooked the ducks up, and one of the mallards happened to fly into my line, got himself wrapped up a little bit, and ended up fighting a duck for a little bit, trying to get him in so I could cut the line. Uh, luckily, he wasn't hooked. It was just wrapped around his legs or his body. Um, my buddy ran up and cut it right away, didn't mess around with it. And the duck flew off just fine, nothing wrong with it. Uh, obviously, I don't like to do that, but what can you do? Oh, oh, there's a nice fish. Oh yeah. I got something good on Colton. Yeah. Dude, it feels real good. Oh my gosh. It's an absolute tank, dude. Grab him for me, please. Oh, yeah. You got a smell on you? No, I don't. Do you? No. Nice fish. Right on the Texas rig with a uh, California red crawl, I believe, is what the uh, title is. Solid three and a half, four pound largemouth there. I'll take that any day of the week. you go baby and we got some friendly boaters that like to cut right through the hot spot there oh well I mean you gotta share the lake with everybody I guess where are you thinking oh there's another one yeah oh it's another big one another big one Oh! That's another same size, probably another four pounder. There we go. Another real solid bass on another Texas rig. Just throwing it out deep and dragging along the bottom. Take that.
I have one more spot left in mind. Going to go meet up with Mikey. Colton had to go. It um, was a blast fishing with him. Thanks for coming out. It's getting to be that time where it should be hitting top water time. i got a whopper plopper tied on, hoping to get in some good fish. And I'll keep you guys posted. Catch up with you in a bit. Here's a better one. Oh, that looks like a good one. I think he's foul hooked. Nope. It's a good bass. Real nice bass. It's a lot better top water fish there. He's off. What's going on guys? I don't know if there's much light left, but just finished a great evening of fishing. Caught two awesome fish. Both of them are probably in my top five best bass of my life so far. Um, had a crazy run in with a duck. That's absolutely never happened to me before. I just kind of casted near a dock that the ducks happened to be laying on and they flew off and one got caught up in my line. Luckily my hook was buried into my craw so it didn't get hooked or anything like that. The line was just kind of wrapped around its body. Um, we managed to bring it in and cut the hook off and it unraveled itself and flew out on its own. So thankfully the duck was all right. Um, I hate doing that but you can't really control those things. So I'm sorry if that offended you at all by kind of getting into that, but just kind of wanted to document that crazy happening there. <laughs> 